hi everyone this is me bilal malik from microcontrollerslab.com if you want to know more about me you can visit my website microcontrollerslab.com in this video i'm going to present you a simulation of a digital multimeter if you want to read more about digital multimeter using pic microcontroller you can go to my website microcontrollerslab.com and click on this link digital multimeter using uh, circuit and code using pic microcontroller here you can find a complete information about digital multimeter and uh, this multimeter will, uh, will display AC voltage, AC current, power factor and frequency of AC supply. You can also add the feature of uh, uh, DC uh, voltage, DC current and DC power and uh, let's start with the simulation of uh, uh, digital multimeter. Uh, let me first explain you uh, a little about, about this circuit. Here uh, is input power supply and this is uh, load and and this is a uh, potential transformer because microcontroller cannot treat uh, voltage more than 5 volts so we have to step down this voltage using potential transformer uh, this uh, this is a potential transformer it will step down voltage from 220 volt to uh, 12 volt and after that uh, we are using rectifier half wave rectifier circuit uh, this is a uh, di diode using as a half uh, half uh, half wave rectifier and here we are uh, taking this signal uh, to microcontroller this signal is uh, connected with microcontroller AC through potential divider because here we are getting 12 volt and uh, uh, microcontroller cannot read uh, voltage more than 5 volts so we are using voltage divider to uh, further divide this voltage to 1 and 10 parts so uh, voltage appearing on analog pin of this uh, pic 18 f 450 microcontroller will be less than 5 volt and this circuitry is used for zero, zero crossing detection and uh, uh, why we are using zero crossing detection circuit because uh, we need to measure uh, a time between current and uh, current wave and, and uh, voltage wave because the time difference between uh, current wave and uh, current wave and the voltage wave will be help us to measure uh, uh, power factor because power factor is basically a displacement between current waveform and voltage waveform and this signal is connected with uh, uh, with uh, our interrupt uh, interrupt zero pin and similarly here we are con uh, connected a load and uh, in series with the load we are connecting our CT CT is a current transformer and we are making uh, because CT will give us output in the form of current so we are converting this current into voltage through this shunt resistor and voltage appearing this shunt resistor will be measured with the help of uh, uh, ADC uh, with the help of AN1 which is analog to digital converter of built-in analog to digital converter pick microcontroller after that we uh, after that we are again using a zero contact, uh, crossing detection circuit which will help us to measure uh, uh, a time difference between voltage and current waveform here we are using LCD to display the values of voltage, current, power factor and frequency and uh, here is one more pin uh, here we are uh, getting a signal from uh, 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 amplifier and we are uh, connected this uh, 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 sorry we are getting uh, uh, getting output from uh, uh, rectifier and we connected this with uh, this uh, this uh, uh, timer uh, clock pin to measure frequency so let's start the simulation uh, as you can see uh, load is connected and it is glowing and uh, now uh, first of all you can see uh, it is displaying voltage to uh, 257 volt and current of 1.90 ampere frequency of 50 hertz and uh, uh, because simulation is not running real time as you can see higher simulation is not running in real, real time due to excessive CPU load so uh, it will take some time for the power factor to display uh, as you can see uh, it is 5.5 5.6 and it is not a real time simulation but when you when you design this circuit in real time it will uh, appear in uh, all the uh, parameter will display after four to five seconds uh, so uh, this is a description of uh, uh, simulation of, of uh, digital multimeter uh, I am only using uh, AC uh, values here but you can uh, design it for DC as well as uh, as well here you can see it is showing power factor 0.97 by power factor 977 because we are using uh, uh, only a lamp and lamp is kind of a resistive load so I hope you uh, 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 understand the, uh, the working of this circuit if you want to read more about it you can go to my website micro 
www.tolerancelab.com and here you can find the complete details on uh, digital multimeter and details of its components and circuit diagram thanks for watching this video